Eventia. Okay, Eventia and Luis. Okay, yes. Luis. Uh, Eventia and she want to start first. Ladies first. <laughs> I can, yeah. So can, I can go now? Yeah. yeah. Hi, everyone. Uh, last week, I spoke with my classmate, uh, Luis. Uh, we had a, a very nice conversation. I was so happy about him. Uh, tonight, I will tell you a little bit uh, about him. Oh, who is Luis? Luis is a friendly person, polite, and respect all people. Uh, and about, uh, about uh, make him happy, naturally, Luis is a happy person. He's happier when he have planned to go into his hometown, when he have when he take holiday, and when he go into Kano. And I ask him about uh, why what he miss more to his hometown. Uh, he told me he miss his family, his friend his food, and the summer time. Uh, about favorite holidays, he likes, he likes Christmas. For this holiday, he used to always receive a lot of gifts because he is a good person. And also, he likes Christmas. He likes Christmas decoration, Christmas song, and he has always more time to dinner with his family. Always make his favorite dish. Dish. He, he favorite, his favorite dish is barbecue. He can make it because it's easy to prepare. We said he prepare to he prepare the meat. When he finish, he put the sauce barbecue and the meat. And the meat after putting in the barbecue, barbecue grill and he let it cook slowly. Uh, I asked him about what means being physical, physical at school. He said nothing because if he can't always he can if he can't always stay stay that way, it will be better for him because he used to come to school he lost time in the traffic and he expends more. About the pet I asked him if someone give him a pet, he told me it will be a best friend and the best gift for him because he likes pet too much. And I asked him how Mary changed his life in the positive way. He told me he been married more twenty years. He said, "My life make me always happy. He stay always together in the best and in the bad time. And about uh, someone, I ask him." If someone give you $100,000, what do you do? He, he told me I, he would like to, to take time to stay home, spend time to his wife, travel a lot, pay his bill, and buy everything he wants. It was all 
and I was so happy to talk with him. Thank you, Luis, for sharing with your qualities. Thank you, all people. Thank you, Vencha. Yeah, um, I have a very nice uh, conversation with the Vencha last uh, week. I uh, was around for 40 minutes. Um, I'm asking uh, to her a few questions. Uh, what she is looking for in a partner, what she is missing about her city or country, what they make her happy or may hungry, and what uh, she will do if she have uh, money, and what is favorite holiday for her, and what is poor, uh, she does like it. And, and she told me, uh, for her, the most important uh, to, uh, in, in, in a partner, uh, it has to be smart and very intelligent, okay? Royalty, you know, and also uh, pay attention to her, dedicate time to her and her uh, children and family. Uh, be a romantic person, okay? And for her, the money is not, is not the important things in a relationship. That is good to know that. She's, in, she's a very nice person. Um, also uh, about, um, she miss a lot of things about the bathroom. Uh, special, uh, she miss her uh, family, parents, and friends. And also she miss her, her job in Haiti um, because she's working um, in accounting. But she know she have to um, study here for um, work as an accountant in Canada. Uh, she have to dedicate more time to school. Mm -hmm. um, she's, um, she's very happy. Uh, she's very happy uh, spend, spending time with her children and friends. Um, Sorry, Carmen. If she has uh, money, she will go in a cruise around the world. And also the holiday for her is, um, is Christmas. It's, it's, it's very important. And she really likes it Christmas time. And she enjoy all months, all December. Okay, she likes uh, putting uh, putting decoration in his house. Uh, uh, she likes to meet a uh, family, friend, sing Christmas jingle, and on twenty four, um, she plays all the gifts in the Christmas trees, and um, to keep the hope and make children happy to the next year, uh, next uh, day when they have to open the gift. Um, that is the most exciting uh, and beautiful moment for her. Um, she don't like uh, any sport, but she like to, to do some exercise at gym. She like to go to the gym to do some exercise. Um, for her, the friends is they are very, very important because she likes to have someone to talk, love, and dance. Um, and, sh and share the good and bad moments, especially where, when your family is far away from her. Uh, she told me uh, Facebook is uh, good because it's uh, keep in touch with the family and friends. Um, 
it's a good tool for uh, for uh, using for Eng English class uh, too. Uh, it's about the, the question about the security for the social media. Uh, she is very carefully about security and privacy, especially because uh, at home she has two uh, children <coughs> and she always keep their eyes open and uh, uh, when they use the computer and internet, uh, uh, social media. Um, and in general, it's, it's, it was really nice to have that conversation with Eventia. She is a very hard uh, working person, and she is a very nice, a very nice lady. Um, and she is uh, she had uh, she came to Canada uh, with two boys and she will have to work hard and it's very tough for her because it's tough for everybody to come into canada is but she has two children it's more hard you know and um she is a is hard working person and very nice mom she's is uh from my you, for my conversation, uh, she's gonna have very good life in Canada. I wish all the best to her in this new life in Canada. Thank you, Luis. Okay, clap for Eventia and uh, Luis. Okay, so just let, let just me uh, let me just read what I what I wrote. Okay, very, okay, I'm going to start with Luis. Very effective introduction. You immediately celebrated your um, experience with uh, Eventia. The way you describe her personality is amazing. And you're a gentleman. And uh, you had good vocabulary. In the beginning, during the last, uh, the, during the first um, seventy percent of your presentation, you had perfect eye contact. You were looking at your notes and you're also looking at the camera. But on the latter la latter part, you lost some eye contact. Mm -hmm. And uh, you're very precise when your your pronunciation is crystal clear. You are so precise when you are talking, and the information that you um, gave us about Eventia you carefully I, I can tell but you really listen to what eventia was telling you during the conversation for you to come up with precise vocabulary like one by one and you put them together describing eventia it means that you listen to her a hundred percent okay and that is very very important you listen to her very seriously and you were interested in what you were what she was telling you. And uh, and I'm very sure that Eventia had a great time talking with you, okay? Because women in general, they like uh, people who listen, okay? Mm -hmm. And um, your, your pacing is a little bit slow. You know, when, mm -hmm. when you were talking, it's so clear, yes. it's so lovely, but it's a little bit slow, like not mm -hmm. the, the timing. It's a little bit slow. It did not affect your presentation, but it's a little bit slow. You could have gone faster. Um, yeah. And with Eventia, with Eventia, you had short intro and you immediately talk about Luis. Like immediately after your short intro. And this works for you because sometimes if your introduction is too long, it becomes boring, but your introduction is short and immediately you jump into the information that you collected when you interviewed uh, Luis. And um, you were looking at your notes most of the time. However, your articulation, your pronunciation is very clear. You surprised me today. Very clear pronunciation. 
and easy to understand events here. Congratulations. Uh, you need more energy, you know, when you speak. You need more energy. I think um, like Malet, you know, you, you and like, for example, you and Malet, you know, I think you need to be more comfortable first before you will be, before you will go all out, right? I, I know this personality and I'm not worried because you have the beauty you have the intelligence, you have the, 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 the good personality, you are headed in that, uh, in that direction. Mm -hmm. And I love the way you ended your, pre your presentation, uh, Eventia. I was touched when you spoke about Louise from your heart. You know, you ended your presentation in a heartfelt way, and that is an excellent ending. Okay, so congratulations. Okay, okay, so okay, next, everybody. Uh, can I go, teacher? Teacher, me? How was that? Can I go, teacher? Hashmat. Uh, teacher. I, teacher. Oh, so I heard a lady talking. Hasina? Teacher or Hasina? Sana, I'm me, Carmen. No, no. The, the people, Carmen. the people with no partners, you will be last. Oh. Please, okay? And, uh, so okay, can I go so, now? Uh, Hasmatula, is your partner here? Yes, he is here. Atnan, are you here? Yes, it's your yes, <laughs> Oh <Yes>. my god. <laughs> Look at the Hasmatula. He said, Yes, he is here. Adnan, are you here? <laughs> yes, I'm here. <laughs> Beautiful. Okay, okay. So Hasmatula and Adnan, you are next. Okay, Atnan, do you want to first? You're older than me. I will give you the no, no, the I chance. Give Please start you. Okay, sure. I will start. So, hi everyone. Today, today I want to explain the the conclusion or the summary of our conversation that we had on last evening, on last Friday evening. Uh, I was at work when uh, when Mr. Adnan called me that are you able to do our our conversation now? I request him that I'm in job site now. I cannot. I'm not able to do our conversation now. Can we do it later? He told me where are you working? I told him that I'm working in Miss Saga. So he told me that I'm living in Miss Saga too. He asked me about, uh, I asked him about address by chance. It was only seven minutes uh, far, uh, far between us. So I told him that I will, I will meet you face to face to have a good conversation together. When I finished my job, when I finished my job, uh, I went to his place and I meet him. First of all, I want to say that that he's a very hospitable person because he served me because he served me different types of beverages different type of beverages and he's a very so we start our conversation and i ask him i don't want to say what i have asked him i just want to introduce him to you guys i want to say that he's a very humble fr uh, friendly friendly, confident, creative, and helpful person. And helpful person. And uh, and his friends are so important for him. Especially, uh, especially when they help him, when they help him to handle the stress and problems on his bad situations. But, Asmatola, your, your sound is not is not good. He is frozen. Yeah, Asmatola is good frozen. now. My, I think my internet is not good, working properly. I don't know why. Is it fine now? It's okay now. 
Thank you. That's not my... <laughs> that... I don't know why, what, what happened to my internet. That's not working good today. Is it fine now? Yeah, May continue. Continue? continue. Okay. Yes, continue. Okay, sorry everyone. So, so he he told me about a famous person uh, in the world. He, his name was Nelson Mandela. He was he was the president of South Africa, who was found out uh, 27 years 27 years for their goals until he achieved uh, until he achieved freedom for for their nation, for the their nation, and. I see, I watched him that he was a very open-minded and educated person because he told me that education is very, very important. Because he told me that education is very important for us because it helps us to learn law. He told that only educated, only a, an educated person can, can solve their problem easily. And can can def can identify difference between good and bad. Mr. Atnon told that uh, his favorite uh, his favorite holiday is Family Day because he like he like it when the all the all all the members of the family gathered all around together and having dinner and having lots of fun all together. And he he's very good and professional in playing chess, playing volleyball, and playing snooker. Uh, we we played we played chess together. He's very prof he playing very professionally, and I don't remember the the, the year, but he he has got he has been got the 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 first position in the in the snooker championship. Back home, yeah. on yes, he <laughs> told me, but by chance I, I I forgot. I forgot the year. Then he can told later. So, uh, Adnan Adnan told me that he is missing missing his childhood, his childhood, his friends, his friend, his relatives on his back home. And at the end, uh, he mentioned uh, that a very strong, a ver he mentioned a very strong and and meaningful sentences about getting married. Getting married means having a life partner and family, and family that support that support and help each other and and be there for each other in the bad situations. He like and love uh, his wife so much because uh, she's she's the one who was who was make a very better, strong, and a nice hurt man. And at the end, he told me that he he will never like or he will never wanna get married with any other lady ever. Thank you so much for your attention. Mm -hmm. Okay, Adnan. Yes, sir. Down the line. Can I start? Yes. Okay. Hello, our amazing teacher. Hello, my friend. I hope you are doing well. In the beginning, I want to thank Mr. Andrew for his beautiful idea of this test. It made us get to know each other more and more. My talk will be about our brother Hishmatallah. He is from Mazar Sharif city in Afghanistan. He studied civil engineering. Engineering. He is married and he and his wife are expecting their first child on May 28. They arrived in Canada six months ago. Now he worked very hard in construction field. 
seven days a week. And same times he continue, he continues study English without any complaint. I appreciate and respect him. He visit me at my house. And during our conversation, we knew a lot of about each other. I felt that he is intelligent, extremely responsible, respectful, energetic, educated, hard worker, generous, and so, so kind man. I think it is so, and more than that. My first question on my first question for him was what quality are you looking for in a friend his answer was very smart he said the one that i found beside me in my diff my difficult time and a friend who is loyal honest and helpful and to know his mood in different situation i ask him what makes him happy sad and angry his answer was very small thing like nice behavior make me happy loneliness make me sad terrorism make me so angry after that, I told him, if I gave you one million dollar, what would you do with it? He said confidently, I would build a charity, charity foundation to help and support the, home, the homeless and the needy people. Then I asked him, what do you miss? most about being physically at school funny answer he said i have really missed the hubbub of school and walking through the school area i like answer i like his answer when i ask him please tell me something you are really good at he said i am good at make friends After that, I said to him, would you please tell me about your favorite holiday and how do you celebrate it? He said, my favorite holidays are Eid and New Year's days. In these days, we visit and invite all our family and the close friend. Sorry. After this question, we take a coffee break and the play chess. <clears throat> Sorry, we play chess and he surprised me that he was a good player. Then we we back to the question. I need to see this. Okay, I will show you. <laughs> I ask him. Okay, I ask him what kind of game or sport you are good at. He told me, I am good at playing volleyball and chess. I have been playing volleyball as a member of our school team for three years. And I often play chess with my co-worker and, uh, fr and, and friends. Okay, sorry. Then I asked him, are friends important to you? He said, the friends, it's too important to me. As friends, we help each other and spend good time together. The last question I asked him was, how important is the education to people? He said, education help people to grow and develop. Educated people can shape their society by knowing and 
respect, right, and and the law. I think I finished. Thank you, my friend, for listening. I hope my information was beneficial for you. Love for Asmatullah and Adnan. <laughs> you know, the best thing about what you did, Asmatullah and Adnan, is I'm very surprised that you met. <laughs> I'm very surprised that Asmatullah came to your house and yeah and played chess with you and interviewed you in person. And yeah. what is more surprising is you allowed him to come. <laughs> and so, and your family saw him, right? No, because we are sitting in the basement. No, no, but when he came, the fa your family did not see him? Yes. Okay, okay. Yeah, so I thought, I thought like you, you like everybody saw him. So Adnan, uh, fantastic introduction. I loved your introduction when you were when you started your presentation about Hasmatullah. That was beautiful. Like the way you and you gathered a lot of information about your conversation partner. You gathered a lot of information uh, about Hasmatullah from him, and uh, and you did a great job storytelling. It's a little bit too slow when you were talking, but I think the reason why you were slow is because you're trying to be careful in order to communicate better, more clearly. Like I, I think that's the reason. And um, you're, um, you, you've got to be careful with your grammar when you're talking. And also, um, like I know that you are not the only one. Like also, also some students they did the same thing. I told you, like during your presentation, you don't need to read the question again. Okay, you can just go directly, just like what Muhammad Obeid did. Remember, I told you the way he connected his uh, his sentences, her stories, very very effective. Okay, and your pronunciation is very clear, Adnan. And I'm very happy that you're able to do that. And also, you were talking from your heart. Okay. And I saw and I know that you really enjoyed this connection with Hasmatullah when you met and you were playing. And it's a good thing, you know, that you know you took a break a little bit and then you played chess. And and did you serve Hasmatullah some drinks? Adnan? Yes, I present to him juice and Turkish coffee. And some sweets. Yes. Yeah, because yes. I know Arab people, they like, they, like type of beverage. they like tea. They like tea. Arab people, they like tea. Okay? So, yeah, thank you so much. You you went um, all the way to meeting each other. And that is a very good beginning for a nice uh, friendship. Okay, so Asmatullah your introduction is a little bit too long okay and um and but you threw an idea you know the best thing about your presentation has matula is this you you took information from adnan and then you put your information into one sentence and then you supported your information with um, information that you gathered from Adnan and that is a very good strategy that is a very very good strategy you have a style in uh, in speaking yeah you said something and then you supported what you said because some people they just say something and that's it but you you were so careful you said something and then you explain what you said and that is the best part of your uh, presentation and the, the next one is you were very organized. You were doing this, bam, 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 bam. You were very organized when you were uh, telling the sto your story about, about Adnan. And you even have a, had a style of, um, of including, including quote, 
into your presentation, you added some quotes about getting married. You know, yes. And also, you sounded like a nice person. Your pronunciation is very clear, easy to understand, and people will enjoy listening to you because you have this voice that is, um, in Spanish, they call it suave. <laughs> Look at Andrea. <laughs> Your voice is suave. Suave means it's smooth and cool. Suave. You have that, uh, Hasmatullah. So congratulations, Adnan and Hasmatula. I hope that you will continue your friendship. You know, because yes, sorry. yeah, it's it's a very good idea. You know, and Hasmatula, I know you're a new student, but Adnan really is a very hardworking, nice gentleman. You know, and so I know, I know, I know Adnan, right? And Thank you. Uh, yes, okay. so congratulations. I forgot, I mm -hmm. forgot to that. I forgot to say that I I like to have. I like to have friends always older than me, educated than educated than me because I'm a learner. I'm a learner. I always want to learn yes. something from Mohammed experience Obed, of older Mohammed Obed said and, the same thing, you know, and uh, yeah. Okay. Yep. So 